Everything in life I've learned from my mother. When I've been rejected, dumped, hurt, or disappointed, she's always directed me towards the beauty of loving each other. She's taught me all the basics. Always eat your broccoli, don't cheat in Monopoly, don't settle for less, and yes, mother really does know best. She's taught me that love is beautiful because it's not exclusive to beautiful things. It's easy to love those who make you smile, but for those who make you cry, that's when love is truly worthwhile. She's taught me that lover is synonymous to giver. It's about setting the extra seat at the table when you know he's not coming home for dinner. It's about shaking it off when your kid gives you their cough. About playing it cool when you get the worst end of the carpool. It's giving without expecting, caring without possessing. Because love is never selfish, it has no motives or ultimate objective. It's there because it needs to be. Because it's the only thing that makes sense in a life of absurdity. So when tax papers label you as just the homemaker, I like to rip that all up and rewrite it to beauty maker. Because when you decided to love me, that's when I became beautiful. And when you teach me how to love, I can make anyone beautiful. And I'm about to leave, about to face this world out on my own. But don't worry, because you planted the seed inside me, the seed that after 18 years has finally grown. 18 years, you've watered me with love. You've taught me which weeds to mind and which ladybugs to find. You planted me in the sunlight, but taught me that when winter comes, you need to just dig deeper into the soil and fight. You are the gardener of my life. I bloom because of you. I am your tulip, your sunflower, your doc Malie, your pansies painted blue. And when spring comes and I bloom with great color and beauty, you're always there to remind me that petals will fall, so don't lose your humility. And when the days get cold, and it seems like I've been forgotten, you say, have faith, because your roots are still strong, and you have many spring summers until you are rotten. It's a cycle, I know, where we all end up decomposed. I'll crawl back into the earth and be gnawed on by caterpillars and worms and bacteria in the dirt. But I know I'll never actually disappear because all the love and beauty you've invested in me will be carried by the wind and the bodies of bees. My energy will be transformed, but it will not be replaced because true love is recycled, living through copy and paste. And you've spent nearly half a century in the cycle of life as daughter, sister, mother, and wife. It's inevitable that your eternal winter will come. But just know that you will live every spring, summer, fall because you have given me your love so that I can grow and be tall. And before I leave next year, I will hold you and thank you and wipe away your tears. And I will tell you, my mother, that I will take the seed you planted in me and I will turn it into a field of sunflowers and a forest of evergreen trees.